Good afternoon. I'm waiting for the sunset, pero umuulan ngayon. Kaya, basang basa yung rooftop. But then, I will remember things that uh, God is giving us. Giving us the rain and the sun. For this is part of our life. Kuminsan ang buhay natin ay ulan. Kuminsan naman, punong-puno siya ng sunshine, liwanag. I remember a very common text in the Bible, in John 3.16. For God so loved the world that He gave His only Son, that whosoever believes in Him should not perish, but have everlasting life. We're going to separate this context of the verse for God so loved the world. First, we're going to uh, remember the position of Jesus when he was there in heaven. Jesus occupied the most important thing in heaven as one of the Godhead. And uh, if we will read the Bible from the Old to the New Testament. We can really see how important His work is on salvation of men. For God so loved the world. It's that God so loved the world. When we say world, we're talking about people. We're not talking about anything. About the place or the whole globe as a world. But we are talking about people, people in particular, for God to love the world. In context, when you say people, when you say world, it refers to people living in this world. God so loves you and me that he, they, the three Godhead had planned for our salvation. And uh, the next is for God to love the world that he gave you may be giving without love but you cannot love without giving so giving is a gift that we should give us to be the best when we give gifts kailangan ito ay the best so the best gift that heaven could bestow to the world is no other than Jesus when we contemplate on the life of Jesus he was uh, the son he was um, worshipped by the angels and is the precious one of the precious um, uh, God in heaven but then because of this great love of God for us, when they planned for salvation, for redemption, Jesus volunteered to come to this earth and uh, has sacrificed even his life, even unto the death on the cross. So when we say... Uh, best gift there's no other best gift that heaven can give us but jesus just remind me of people like us we give do we give the best gift that we have for our children for example for our uh, neighbors or friends or workmates and even our friends we always uh, choose the best for them hindi tayo magbibigay ng mga bagay na masisira na or dahil mapapanis na we should give the best so heaven best gift to us is, is Jesus and he is the most precious gift that he, heaven has bestowed for humanity for the world for God to love the world that he gave so 
because God loves us. God give. God gives the best. That He gave His only begotten Son. See, His only begotten His only precious, the only begotten Son of God. And uh, being the best gift that heaven can give for us. For without Jesus, we will never, never be saved. Without the blood of Jesus, we will never be saved. And uh, giving is not just sort of giving. For God to love the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believes of Him, and here comes our faith, here comes our belief, and that God who have bestowed the best gift. Here comes our acceptance of the gift. That whosoever believes on him should not perish. So it is a thing that will uplift our lives, that will uh, uplift our downgraded humanity. Uh, we are supposed to die because of our sins, but Jesus died instead for us. So Jesus uplift the condition, the rotten condition of humanity. He said, For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, and whosoever believes, okay, this is the only condition that God has given us. If you believe, then you will be saved. That whosoever believes should not perish, but have everlasting life. So giving the best, giving the best we have is something that will uplift them, uplift our friend and family, and lift, uplift them higher than the normal status they have been occupying. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son. Whosoever believes in Him should not perish, but have everlasting life. What do we have to give? What do we have to give to our children? What food should we parents give to them? What discipline are we going to give to our children? What kind of education is part of it that we are giving to our children? giving the best to a friend, to a family, to your children, my children, and even to our relatives, is giving something that will uplift their status, that will draw them higher, and their morals will be boosted because of something that we give them. So part of it is giving the message of salvation to them. Giving them the best is giving or sharing the goodness of Jesus in our lives. And giving them the best is uplifting their lives into a more worthy and um, resourceful one. So this is a challenge to each and every one of us. John 3.16 has so many things to offer. God giving His love, His love, His life, life for us, His love for us. And for those who are accepting because of our belief, our faith, will accept Jesus as our personal Savior. It has, he has the power to uplift us, to uphold us into a more noble person, into a more moral uh, person, into a more dignified, worthy to praise God and honor Him. 
So I hope and pray that each and every one of us this morning, this evening, will consider the love of Jesus in our lives and also will do the part to share the message of salvation to the world and help uplift the lives of men and women whom we are in, in contact with every day. Thank you for watching and God bless us.